The Queen City News team is, as I mentioned, hitting the road later this afternoon, showing you everything Gastonia has to offer as part of our Queen City Hometown Series. Queen City News reporter Brad Baldeck is getting us started this morning with a look at a century-old staple in the community that has never changed their successful recipe. Just looking at Tony's Ice Cream Parlor on Franklin Boulevard in Gastonia, you know it's something special to the community. People have been lining up here for their favorite flavors since 1915. We try to do what we can, you know, as a good neighbor in Gaston County. That's been the motto for generations in the Coletta family. My granddad, he, he spent his days going through the the neighborhoods in the mill section, especially up in Firestone. People would come out with bowls and it didn't matter if they had money or not, they still won't get their ice cream. Today, that ice cream comes in 28 different flavors and is made right across the street from the ice cream parlor. The recipe hasn't changed in 100 years. The secret is enhancing the flavor of the ice cream so it's never diluted when making a frozen favorite. The top selling item has always been milkshakes and chocolate is the number one seller. Customers can even buy their favorite ice cream flavors by the pint. If you come hungry, the parlor offers diner style foods at a diner style price. My dad was the one that he told me a long time ago, he said there's a place in this world for things to stay the same. Since the 1960s, Louis Coletta has been here nearly every day. When he's not helping behind the counter, you'll find him sitting in the same red leather booth. Another lesson he learned from his father. He told me, he said, I want you to remember something. He said, don't ever think for a minute that you don't need to be there because somebody has to mind the store. For more than a century, a Coletta has been doing just that. In Gastonia, Brett Baldeck, Queen City News.